Hi, I'm Anne Wawadu. Here's your channel's TV evening news recap for May the 13th, 2020. President Muhammad Buhari has appointed renowned diplomat and former Minister of External Affairs, Professor Ibrahim Gambari, as his new Chief of Staff. The Secretary to the Government of the Federation, Mr. Boss Mustafa, announced the appointments before the commencement of the Federal Executive Council meeting on Wednesday. Meanwhile, the Federal Executive Council has approved the revised medium-term expenditure framework and the 2020 budget. The revised estimates are based on $25 per barrel of crude oil at a production rate of 1.94 million barrels per day. In Ondo State, a military officer identified as Captain Ghana has been kidnapped by some gunmen along Algoa Akoko in Akoko Northeast local government area. The officer was set to be traveling alone in his car from Abuja to Ibado when he was kidnapped and taken into a nearby bush. On the international scene, Europe moved ahead with its emergence from coronavirus lockdown on Wednesday and laid out plans for summer tourism. But the pandemic gathered pace elsewhere, and America's virus point man warned against reopening the United States too quickly. Desperate to save millions of tourism jobs, the European Union set up plans for a phased restart of travel this summer, with EU border controls eventually lifted and measures to minimize the risks of infection, like wearing face masks on shared transport. Adding sports, Premier League players are set to be subjected to a strict testing regime if they are to return to training amid the coronavirus pandemic. According to British media reports, the BBC says on Tuesday it had seen a copy of its official protocols sent to all 20 Premier League clubs, detailing the need for corner flags, balls, cones, goalposts and even playing surfaces to be disinfected after each training session. And that's your evening news recap. Join us tomorrow for fresh updates. I'm Anne Mwawadu. Thank you for watching.